I left the cabinet open. <laughs> oh, I'm so bad at doing that. Just, just ignore my dishes. Anyways, hey guys, welcome back to Don't Catch Your Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Wednesday, May 19th. Yes, I remembered it. <laughs> I'm a little flushed because I just saved a spider's life. <laughs> I'm trying really hard not to kill uh, animals or, you know, anything <laughs> except the, ex the, ex the, um, what am I trying to say? The exceptions are black widows and brown recluses because they're poisonous, <laughs> venomous, whatever. But this was just a little striped spider, and he was he had a little web in the house. Uh, because I guess I didn't clean good enough, but uh, I saved him. But he also fell, and I had to catch him, and then I had to get him outside, and it was scary. But anyways, he's outside. He's alive. He's doing whatever spiders do. Um, yeah, what am I saying? Okay, today's Wednesday. <laughs> um, I'm fixing my phone. It's a little crooked. Left the cabinet open. Um, it's disheveled. I'm disheveled. I'm still recovering from my allergies, but Tennessee, it's allergy season is like April to November, so I don't know how well I can recover. <laughs> but I'm still taking medicine and it's helping. But, uh, anyways, today <laughs> is the day that we now are talk about the movie and stitch eye, um, square movie <laughs> and uh so i last week i said i was gonna do a different movie or not last week last video um but i ended up because we've been so busy with uh karate stuff and just regular you know personal things going on and we had to go to uh, graduation and just all this stuff going on i didn't have time to watch <laughs> a new movie so i went ahead and just uh made my eye square off of an eye movie that i've already seen and it's on disney plus anyways if you want to check it out it's called inside out it's a really good movie. It's a cartoon. It's like a uh, Pixar, I guess, animated movie. And it's, it's, I like it a lot because it's about, um, emotions and the whole like moral of the story is that sometimes, you know, that's okay to be angry and sad. And, you know, sometimes you have to feel those things to, uh, be happy is <laughs> basically the moral of the story. And, um, so I've always really loved that movie since it came out and it's real funny too, because it's a cartoon and, uh, I'll absolutely love the little sadness person she's so funny and um relatable <laughs> but yeah so i made a square from that so i use my scrap balls i used for the base of the square i used a pattern that's called uh simple says it best i think i'll link it in the description it's just a simple square <laughs> and um i used red heart super Sever amethyst for that and then i used scrap balls for the rest of them i don't really know what they all are but here's my I square. I feel like it's huge. It came out bigger. So I made a bunch of different circles in the different colors for the fillings of the movie. <laughs> the movie poster is purple. And then yellow is joy. Uh, green is like envy and jealousy. Blue is sadness. Red is anger. And purple is fear in the movie. <laughs> so um, I just made the little circles to represent the core memories because in the movie there when you make a core memory which is a memory that you always you know remember it is like a glowing orb <laughs> so that's what that's supposed to represent but um yeah so i this is bright yellow the original bright yellow spring green and uh cherry red but i don't know what these two colors are because they're just scrap balls and then the back the base is uh amethyst <laughs> But yeah, so it doesn't matter which way it goes. I'm just I just made circles and sewed them on there. <laughs> but um, it's very inside outy. If you see the movie, it um it looks good, I think. <laughs> but yeah, so that's my I square, and uh, I really like the movie. I, I finished my thing finally, and I definitely give it a five star. I give almost all my movies five stars. I overblocked them. They're kind of crunchy, <laughs> but that's okay. They work. Um, they're still pinned on there with uh, stitch workers. <laughs> But that's my marquee so inside out gets five star rating of course because it's awesome so for my j movie right j yeah <laughs> um i'm gonna go ahead and pick another movie that i know i've already seen but i'm gonna probably rewatch it and i'm gonna try to watch it with jesse because he's seen the new one but i know he hasn't seen the original one it might scare him though i don't know maybe it'll be okay but it's gonna be the original jumanji <laughs> the one with robin williams i do like the newer movies they're good, but they're just not as good as the original one. So I'm going to rewatch it. Um, and that movie is a big part of my childhood. <laughs> it came out when I was a kid. And I remember having the board game. And me and my siblings and cousins used to like play Jumanji. Um, so it was a lot of fun. But uh, I love that original movie. It's just so good. And it's got a Bonnie Hunt in it. And uh, Robin Williams. And the guy that plays as his dad slash 
the guy with the gun. <laughs> I don't remember what his name is. Uh, he's a really funny actor too. I can't remember what his name is. But he's really funny. I love him on Richie Rich also. He's the um, butler, I guess, on Richie Rich. <laughs> Another 90s movie that I absolutely love. But yeah, so my, my J movie is going to be Jumanji, the original one. Because I love that movie. I pretty much love anything from the 90s because I was a kid in the 90s. But uh, yeah, so that's my stuff. <laughs> I'll link below the other people who are participating in this collab. Oh, I have a thing to show you. Let me go get it. Okay, anyways, like I said, I'll link below the original people to start the collab and participate in it, which is Terry, uh, Valerie, and Lee, and me. <laughs> and, um, and then a lot of people I was also like tagged on to start doing it too. But uh, I got a thing from Terry from Yarn Drum Podcast in the mail. She's the one who came up with the idea for it and asked us to participate. So she sent me and the rest of them a <laughs> uh, thank you note thanking us for participating in her collab. <laughs> and she made us little uh, notion pouches. So here it is. It's movie themed. <laughs> and there's a stitch marker or a pull on here that is a um, like a old camera <laughs> like a you know the kind of records with the reels and a cute little gem and it's just really cute and the inside's got like x's really pretty little and it's squishy cute little notions pouch so we can always remember our hashtag movie and stitch um collab <laughs> which is gonna be cool because i'm gonna have this but i'm also gonna have my blanket after the end of the year when we get done and i plan on um Lining the back of my blanket with, uh, what's it called? Fleece? Flannel? Whatever it's called. I always forget which one is which. It's fleece. Um, like I did my Halloween blanket that I made a few years ago. It makes it nice and thick and heavy and soft and nice. I don't have to weave in my ends very good. I just tie them in knots. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So thank you so much, Terry. I'm going to link the other people down below. And there's also a bunch of other people just participating. And all you have to do is go to YouTube and type in hashtag which is the pound sign <laughs> um movie and stitch and it'll bring up all the videos that are and you know people have put that hashtag on so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and hop off here and film a watch work on a wednesday video uh you'll see that before this one though but anyways it doesn't matter <laughs> bye guys <laughs>